monetarily we were very poor, but we were very rich. You did not work on Sunday, period. When he spoke, you better believe every word he said. Mother should have her picture by the definition of that word. Well, Carolyn was always just like a little cricket. He didn't do a bath every day. That's the first place that he thought about dying. I'm just thankful that God permitted us to be here. None of us ever met Granddaddy Young because he died of uh, TB, except at that time they called it consumption. He said that Granddaddy asked him to take care of his mother and his younger brother and sister uh, after he was gone. When he wasn't in school, he was in the field working from about sun up to sundown. It was work. When I was at least three years old, I uh, went to the cotton patch and picked the cotton out of the burrs and would put it in someone else's sack. And I did that until I was old enough to have my own little sack. Well, there's much about them. I don't know how to get it all in. <laughs> I got more whippings than all the other seven children put together. I got a whipping 14 days out of 14. Uh, Joe went into service uh, during World War II when he was 17 years old. And uh, on his way to Okinawa, the, his ship was, he was on, got torpedoed, and that's the first place that he thought about dying. He didn't think that he'd come home alive. There are families now who stop and say, okay, what's important is that we do this as a family. Without families, we're really sunk. We don't have a, a purpose or hope in, in a lot of ways. Lived long enough and observed enough, I really think you need something that brings you together. That to me is what family is all about, is relationships. And we maintain those relationships rather than each going their separate ways and, and staying separate.